Hello and good morning, I'm Neil Pinkett, uh, the proprietor of Bath Cars, and today's car is this three-door Golf. This is a 1.4 match, which has been uh, modified with a few uh, nice little touches, so this will appeal to, uh, I would have thought, a younger type of uh, lad who uh, wants himself a little car that stands out somewhat. Um, it's a 1400cc, so it's low on the uh, tax and insurance. Uh, it has had some 17 inch uh, wheels fitted, and I believe, let's have a look, yeah, they are original VW Audi wheels, uh, painted uh, caliper there in the back. Might be able to check out the pad wear, pads are fine in the back, plenty of wear on those. So, yeah, 17 inch wheels on um, ah, this colour. Now, I used to remember, I think it's inky blue if I'm not mistaken, but it will tell us uh, in the back of the car what the paint code is. I'll have a look at that in a minute for you. Uh, the tyres are all pretty good. This side we've got uh, a virtually brand new tyre. Uh, on what size are they? Let's have a look at this one, it's a bit easier to see. 225-45R17s and the pads on the front have got plenty of meat to go on them as well so all pretty good it's had this uh, eyebrow type spoiler fitted to the uh, front uh, it was on a private registration plate this car I'll show you that in a moment for virtually all its life and in uh, benefit of it it's had just one uh, chap from Bristol own the car who part exchanged it at the main dealer Heritage VW garage uh, so he went on and probably bought himself another either VW or Audi car um, so just one owner so that's pretty good news uh, there is no tax with the car I'm afraid but it does have a nice long MOT uh, one key one remote key which uh, works the alarm and the immobiliser so there it is done two button key so just uh, open and close All working fine this side the tyres uh, again very good condition tyre on the front and the side and on the back here again practically brand new so this car's I think had just uh, brand new tyres fitted all around. Can't have been many uh, hundred miles ago or so, if that. The uh, boot, I'm afraid, has had a little bit of a damage. A crease has been put in the back here. It's not broken the paint, but it has creased it. But it sort of doesn't look too bad because it just sort of uniformly sits there. So it's okay, you know. You can see those wheels are uh, fairly chunky on the back there from a lower view. 2004 car, this one. It's had uh, aftermarket lenses put in the back there as well. Uh, let's just uh, pop the boot and show you the back here. The parcel shelf's missing uh, due to the fact this sound system was upgraded. There are loads of wires and things in the back here. There's a, a steel spare with a decent tyre on it, uh, uh, tool kit. There's the original sticker. I'll get you the paint code if uh, LD, LB5N? LD5N is the paint code. Probably something like inky blue. Heated rear screen, high level brake light, rear wash wiper. I've driven the car for about 20 miles, all drove very well, I've given it a very rough clean, I've just washed it off and uh, blown out the inside with an airline and very basic Hoover, so it's just uh, as it's come at the moment. The glass is all good and it's tinted obviously, as you can see, a heavier tint at the back, not the back screen, slightly lighter tint up front here and uh, hopefully that's all within the legal tolerances. So um, yes, that all works well, let's uh, just jump in the car and uh, I'll show you the inside. So it's got electric windows, electric mirrors and the locking button there. A little bit of wear to the driver's seat. Not much, just a tiny little wear. We've got a bit of black cotton that'll sew up fairly well. Back seats are in reasonable condition. Again, could do with a wet clean really if you wanted to bring them up perfectly. And the uh, pedal rubbers are all good in there as well. So as usual, match spec, uh, digital clock, uh, the uh, MFA system. Uh, traction control, engine light, all go out fine. It is, it is saying service now, but I have checked the oil and the oil is nice and clean. It does have a slightly chattery belt, if you can hear that. There's a belt. That's uh, chattering away, and I'll show you under the engine later. But the clutch is great. There's no problem with the clutch. I would have thought I'd had a, a new clutch at some point. Uh, the clutch bites perfectly and is nice and easy to push down on the pedal, just as I like it. Okay, so alas, no service book or uh, owner's manuals. Now they may come through. I've um, turn this down for a second. They may come through. I've uh, tried to look up this guy on the in the VT phone book. I can't find him. But as you can see, just one owner. Uh, golf match, one key, MOT until late January 2014. Um, three door golf match, 161 grams per kilometre. The MOT certificate's valid until January the 29th. 2014 
and there was one advisory issue which was offside rear brake grabbing slightly so very minimal MOT advisory there and uh, printed out the Vosa history so we can see what the car has been doing over the last uh, seven years or so so back in 2007 it had done 65k uh, in 2008 it had done 77 in 2009 it had done 90k and uh, most of these stations test stations are in Bristol um, 2010 it done 106 2011 it had done 118 uh, 2012 it done 130 so it's been used but that's pretty just a bit over average miles for a car like this um, there is a radio CD player it's got DAB control I'm not sure if it's a DAB I don't think it's a DAB system may have, have an option for it the centre consoles all work okay fuel filler all works fine headlining is in okay condition you can see the glass is all okay there as well right let's go and uh, poke a header under the engine bay here Just bear with me a moment okay you still with me <laughs> right so um, under here we've got uh, Cooler bottles all clean, screen washer topped up, and there's a KN filter that's been mounted directly onto the top of the throttle body control. So uh, that will work okay. And the original airbox is probably still sat there with the pipe, which you don't really need actually, that's secured with a nylon band. Um, but as I said, the oil's fine. There's a slight chattering from this belt, uh, but I would have thought whoever buys this vehicle is probably going to be a bit of an enthusiast and is going to quite happily play about with it. So it just needs a good polish and clean and it may well have that uh, when you come to see it so I hope that uh, explains pretty much all about it it's uh, has it been lowered well I don't know I mean the springs could be uh, I expect you if you're an officiado from uh, on the BWs you'll see that uh, sorry I just got distracted someone beeping me um, yeah so maybe it's been lowered I don't know I'm not sure could be the original springs check your insurance obviously beforehand slightly modified cars carry a, a little bit more of a insurance premium whether or not uh, it counts being modified with a K&N air filter and a, a set of wheels it's debatable but okay I'll leave you with that shot thanks very much for watching speak to you soon bye bye